Hi, I'm George from the YouTube channel CoralFish12G, and this is a pH tester from Measury that I use to test my aquarium's water, but can also be used for many other applications, such as for testing drinking water or for pool maintenance. You may ask, what is pH, and why is it important in regard to aquariums? If your pH is in constant fluctuation or fixed at the incorrect level, it can be extremely harmful to the organisms in your aquarium. Now, testing for pH has come a long way, and I can say from personal experience how hard it is to operate test strips with color charts that are impossible to read. The Measury pH meter provides instant measurements at the touch of a button, and they're displayed electronically on an illuminated screen. The meter is capable of displaying the entire pH scale from 0 to 14 with an accuracy of two decimal places. Testing for and maintaining the correct reading of 8.1 to 8.4 for marine systems helps fish resist illness and also keep coral from calcifying at an accelerated speed. In order to achieve the best results, you should calibrate the device before its first usage. This can easily be done in five minutes using its buttons and the provided calibration solutions instead of a screwdriver required by other devices. Start by filling two glasses each with 250 milliliters of distilled water. Use the 6.86 and 4.0 calibration solutions by pouring each of them into their own glass. Stir both solutions using separate utensils until the powder fully dissolves. Insert the meter's electrode into the 6.86 pH solution. Press and hold down the CAL button for 5 seconds. After you release the button, 6.86 will flash on the display. Once it stops flashing, you can rinse the meter's electrode and move on to the next step. Now, insert the meter's electrode into the 4.0 pH solution. Again, press and hold down the CAL button for 5 seconds. After you release the button, 6.86 will again flash on the screen, but this time, quick press the CAL button and the display will then flash 4.0. Wait until the display stops flashing. Now you may be done calibrating the unit here, but if you're going to be using this meter to test solutions that should read above 7, then you must do one extra step using the 9.18 calibration solution. Insert the meter's electrode into the 9.18 pH solution. Press and hold down the cal button for 5 seconds. After you release the button, you will see a number flashing. Quick press the CAL button two more times and then 9.18 will be the number flashing. Wait for it to stop flashing and now your pH meter is fully calibrated to test solutions that have pH readings above 7. pH should be tested regularly to maintain the ideal conditions and also to foresee any potential problems in water chemistry. The investment in this test equipment will reward your aquarium with happy, healthy, and flourishing inhabitants.